two, breach in five seconds. Breach. Breach. No. Caleb! No! No! Captain, we have to move now. I got him. Hostage is secure. Copy, Lima 3. Hostage secure. Subject 984-240. He's military. We believe that he is second Lieutenant Gregory, U.S. Army. Lieutenant Gregory, is that right? How'd it happen, son? I guess I just lost my way. Army. Good. You'll have an advantage. But you were just kidding, weren't you? Damn it, Marilyn, this isn't a game. If I tell you you can't call, you cannot call. I know. It's just that, you know, sometimes I just need to hear your voice. We do that for each other, don't we, Daddy? You know, Castro may very well be a step up from that stomping out of Goomba she was screwing. Lana sure seems to get around. We could have put a thousand bullets in the Castro by now. Might as well have signed my own death warrant. Christ, that was a mess. The city of Los Angeles received a nuclear bomb threat from an individual by the way of telephone. The call came into KJLA, a local news station. This individual stated that a number of suitcases containing nuclear explosives had been placed throughout the LA area. Well, bad things are gonna happen. George? It was not long and it's going to exact triangulation. Forget it. That area goes on for at least 100 miles or more. That's not good enough. You're damn right it's not good enough. Try and relax, Mr. Bunker. Your nanny's already identified these men from their mug shots. We know exactly who they are. We can close in quickly once they let you know the exact drop point. Hello? Hey, honey. Uh, Emily, keep an eye on your sister. The girls talked me into coming to the state fair. The girls were begging me. It was nice out, so we came. I wish you would just stick to a plan. What plan? You know, you just would have thought that maybe you could have included me in on it. Well, how could we? You're not even here. What's that supposed to it mean? Means I'm here watching the kids and you're off with your girlfriends. You volunteered to do this. I would have thought you'd be happy. I wanted to spend more time with them. Instead, you're criticizing me just like you always do. I do not always criticize you. Come on, Daddy. Let's go to the Ferris wheel. Tom, I got to go. Okay. Driver's license, registration, and proof of insurance, please. Yes, sir. Well, if you keep your hands where I can see them. Where are you boys coming from? Um, my mother's house, sir. Yeah, where are you going to? His house. Mr. Goodbread, why are you driving Tyler's mother's car? Uh, I'm just taking it for a test drive, sir. I haven't driven in a while. Is there a problem, officer? Do me the favor and let me ask the questions. Yes, sir. Hi, Jonathan. Wait, I know you, don't I? You should. You screwed my wife and then drank champagne at my funeral. Richard, but you're dead. Do I look dead to you? Where's Janet? She left me for some internet geek from the Silicon Valley. I'm sorry. It must have been hard for you. Oh, don't kill me. Whatever you want. How about breakfast? <laughs>